Welcome back. Today we're gonna look into our Chinese diesel heater here. Um, I took it already out of the case. It's pretty simple. Just uh, pull the rubber at the bottom, push it backwards this way, and then you can take the whole thing out. The problem we have is that the glow plug is broken. Where is it? Yeah. I had I had issues with starting. It doesn't start anymore. It was stinking like hell. So I I pried the I pried the prong off here, and I had that in my hand. So I think it was it was knackered already, maybe transport damage. So I need to find one. Uh, and I think it's also a bit dirty. It's got about a hundred hours. Uh, approximately because I had it running pretty much all day long for quite a while uh, so I think it's dirty inside as well so I have no idea how it comes apart but most likely we're gonna take these bolts out and see what's inside that's what we're gonna do uh, I can see if I look through the hole this is where the glow plug sits there is a bit of soot inside that may have contributed to the issue but yeah from a, from a technical point it shouldn't be too challenging to get the thing apart I think we need to take the electronics off to get to, get to the bolt and then just take it apart and have a look inside all right let's do that luckily I've got two of those so yeah, just put the other one there I have the workshop warm and uh, yeah let's look inside so it comes apart but it's rather simple. Take it take the screws out and then the fan comes out. Uh, watch the gasket, don't damage it. And uh, apparently there are some more bolts down here. So the fuel pipe has to come off I think. Uh, maybe it just comes out. Ah oh, yeah, it comes out. So wiggle this gasket off carefully. not to damage it and uh, then the fuel pipe comes out with the burner all right let's take these screws out and see what's inside so screws are out and uh, just pull that rubber thing out and that's the burner oh, it's full of soot at the bottom all right so a bit dirty because he was smoking like hell but as you can see there's some shit down there Probably because I was burning some rubbish that needs a bit of a clean. And obviously down here is a bit of gunk as well. Yeah, that makes sense. Because I had issues with starting for quite a while, so I always had to start it three or four times and then it was working. Uh, so the problem is, depends on what you're burning. Um, you need to take it apart every now and then and clean it. Uh, but I think the major problem was actually that uh, glow plug, because I could, when I checked the current here, I could, I did notice that the current was getting lower and lower and lower over time, every time I started it. So I was suspecting there is an issue with the glow plug, but uh, yeah, apparently we have one. So what they do is pretty simple. The glow plug is where the where the fuel comes in and as soon as they pump the fuel in it just fires the glow plug that's what it is so all we need to do is clean it out and uh, let me look inside yeah there's a bit of gunk inside not much really it's mainly it has mainly to do with my fuel I think but um, because it's not the cleanest but honestly it's okay uh, the, the problem is the glow plug and uh, I need to get some spares just in case the other one fails as well from a burning point itself if I look at the burner it looks like burning quite nicely actually 
I think the black suit is only from uh, because it didn't start anymore. It was stinking and smoking. Um, all right, and obviously we have a little obstruction where the fuel comes in. The the burner can't be dismantled. That's one piece. I think even the fuel pipe is actually just yeah, the fuel pipe is soldered in. So that's one piece can't be dismantled. Simple design. Uh, easy to take apart, easy to fix. Um, I'm not disappointed honestly, it's okay. Um, we know what the issue is and uh, we do that every now and then. You take it apart, clean it and it should be alright. So we'll come back when we found a glow plug and then we'll put it together and uh, give it a clean first and then we'll put it together. That's it from this so far. Thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing. Until next time.